The Whippet's coat is short, close, smooth, and firm in texture. Any other type of coat is to be disqualified. Coat color is immaterial in this breed. Color and markings should have no influence on your judging. Bear in mind that old scars and injuries resulting from work or mishaps should not prejudice your evaluation unless they interfere with movement or ability to perform. The whippet's gait is free-moving and smooth, with long, low reach in the forequarters and strong drive from the rear. The correct arch over the loin should be seen when the dog is both standing and moving. Seen from the front, the foreleg should be carried straight forward, turning neither in nor out. They should not cross or interfere with each other. At faster speeds, the legs will converge in a straight line toward the center line of travel. Going away, the rear legs follow in a straight line behind the forelegs with strong propulsion evident. They should neither cross nor interfere with each other. Convergence will be seen at faster speeds. A straight line is maintained from hip to pad. This high wrist action, approaching a hackney gait, is to be penalized. Here, the top line shows excessive arch. The movement is not smooth or efficient. Here is typical movement, characterized by great freedom of action, balance, and symmetry. The forelegs reach forward close to the ground, and the hind legs drive strongly. The correct top line is maintained on the move. A maximum amount of ground is covered with a minimum number of steps. The motion appears smooth and effortless. Finally, a word about temperament. The whippet is amiable and gentle. In pursuit of allure or game, he is capable of great intensity. It is these hunting and chasing qualities, quiet elegance, keenness, speed, and agility that make the whipper such a willing worker and valued companion.